Police are in the get out of this area right now. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. 안녕하세요. Daud Kim. So nowadays it's really sensitive about Palestine issue. It's a little bit hard to say, but I really want to say something. So I turn the camera. So I need your help. It's about building a mosque in Korea. As you know, we are already funding and raised the money to make a masjid in Daegu. So it's already delivered to Daegu Masjid for the construction. And also it will be used for the new masjid in Korea. But of course there were many difficulties. So today I will talk about the details about this. So a few months ago, I studied in Bandung University in Indonesia. And in the meanwhile, I heard a shocking news. The construction of Daegu Masjid is suddenly suspended because of the small construction mistake. Of course, the construction and fixing the mistake is really important, but I think there is some reason for this. Because the situation of the construction is not very good right now. On the front of the construction site, people put there a pig head and do barbecue parties in there. It smells uh, so disgusting. And they protest in front of the construction site. <laughs> So the equipment can't go inside of the construction place. So look at this picture. Currently, this truck is blocking the construction site. And I don't even understand why there's a Israel flex. They said, Islam out, we are scared. Do you want terrorism, violence? We have to protect Korea. Kick out of the illegal immigrants, kick out of the refugees. So yeah, the construction is also important, but it's not easy to expose about this kind of discrimination too. So at that time, I really shocked. Even we are permitted, I can't build a masjid. I mean, it's not easy. So actually, I really couldn't sleep well. For a while so i consider for a couple of days and then i make the conclusion what if i can build the masjid and then maybe the situation can change if i have knowledge about the construction and have the experience and can participate about the construction then even if they disturb us i can lead the construction then I can build a masjid that I dreamed by myself. I think about this so suddenly, though this thought just popped into my head and I said, mashallah. So I returned to Korea and I found a job in construction place. Maybe if you're a follower in my Instagram, maybe you already saw that. So I haven't worked in construction place over two months instead of YouTube. It doesn't mean that I quit YouTube, but I focus on my work in construction place right now. So that's one of the reasons I don't post a lot of videos. So <laughs> I'm sorry about this. But anyway, so actually it's not easy for me me because I have never worked this kind of works before but it's quite really good for me so I woke up 5 a.m. and wash a little bit <laughs> and wear the clothes and go to work I can't take a video inside but I wore hard there are so many people inside and I ate lunch in there I usually eat kimbap because there's no halal foods but it's good <laughs> and then go back home at like 6 p.m. Like I moved the heavy equipment and learning about the basic of the construction. Of course, it's not easy and sometimes it's dangerous. But through this work, I think I can reach my goal, my dream, to build a masjid in Korea and spread the true religion, Islam, in Korea. So I have so much positive energy and work happily, really. Now, wake up 5 a.m. is not easy, but <laughs> I can do it. <laughs> I believe that I have duty to spread our religion to people who need help. And I truly believe that Koreans need Islam. It's not because I'm famous or influencer or something. It's because I'm Muslim. So that's why I also ask you to help. Because we need more financial help to build a new mosque in Korea. I think from now on Daegu Masjid is okay because the construction is going right now and we already paid the whole money for the construction. But building a new masjid now requires more amount of money and time and also there is a legal issue too so i need more financial help even a small amount of money is okay if you want help islam in korea if you want help please donate i will do my best and there is one more thing i want to say about the issue in palestine it's not issue it's like totally one side genocide but I want to ask you, have you ever seen any Korean Muslim organization, groups, or even Korean Muslim influencers talk about this situation? Nobody. No one. It's because Korean government don't want to help Palestine. So nobody say about this. So I understand they don't want to lose their job. But I follow Allah, not the government. And I feel Allah, not the government. I don't think I'm different or like better Muslim. But as a Muslim, I should do what I think this is right as a Muslim. 
So this is why I think we need to make a new Muslim community in Korea. Muslims who are afraid of the government, I think there is no future anymore. So I hope someday I want to make Korean Muslim community along with the project to build a masjid in Korea. A community where we can raise our voice for those in need without worrying about what the government thinks. That's my real goal. And that's my jihad in Korea, not <laughs> with fight. So if it's possible, I think we can do proper dawah in Korea too. I'm sure about this. Of course, I could lose my job and can face a lot of disadvantages. I have already lost many jobs because of this, but, but I think we should do it. And for this, I need your help. It's difficult for me alone, but I can do with you guys. I would like to spread Islam in Korea through your help. And I want to know they realize the beauty of Islam. No matter how, how much is difficult, it's nothing compared to the difficulties of our Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, right? <laughs> So the last thing I want to say, my life totally changed when I know about Islam. I came out of the deep depression and found the light after I embraced Islam. For some people, driving an expensive car or living an expensive house can be a goal of their life. But for me, the purpose of life is joy of Allah. So through the building a masjid in Korea, inshallah, I hope there will be a lot of Korean Muslims someday and they realize the beauty of Islam and embrace Islam from their heart. For Allah, and for our Muslim Ummah, I will do my best. So, please help. <laughs> okay, then thank you so much for watching my video. Take care and be safe. Alhamdulillah, Maasalama. Kamsamida. Annyeong.